Welcome back guys, my name is Shauna. Thank you so much for clicking on my channel, I really appreciate it. Um, so this is a quarantine little haul. I have some things from Lululemon and Aritzia. My Lululemon haul is mainly work clothes. I do work in the hospital as a recreation therapist here in Toronto, Ontario. And I do work with positive COVID patients. So I need things that are durable, easy to wash, and good quality. And then for my Ritzia part of the haul, that one's just for fun, to be honest. I really don't have any place to wear these things. But other than that, we're kind of stuck in our condo here. I go to work, come home, sit on the patio or the balcony and have a drink. And that's really it. I haven't been to a mall or any place like that, just to the grocery store. So all in all, I hope everyone is keeping safe. I know that the world is opening back up, but please just be cautious, wash your hands, and when you need to, wear your mask. So all in all, let's get started. Okay, so this is my first pair of Lululemon pants. So these are the On The Fly joggers in the Luxe Stream. So this is what they look like. They have an elastic waistband, pockets, and it's tapered down at the ankle. I would say these are a little bit expensive. They're $128. However, they are absolutely amazing. They wash so perfectly and they don't lose their color. All you do is throw them in the wash in cold and then hang to dry and they come out like looking like new. So this is what they look like. This is the back. And I would recommend getting them true to size. I am a size six in Lululemon and these are a size six. So yeah, that's my first Lululemon. Okay, so these are my second pair of on the fly joggers. These are more of a navy blue. Uh, they're in the woven fabric, so they're less like a stretchy pant and more like a, like a work pant, I guess you could say. They have the cuffs at the bottom, just like the other one. I got these in a size six. They're still $128, but these are the woven fabric. These are a little bit lighter. I do like these better, but for $128 with the pilling, they're definitely not worth it. I didn't realize that you could see my cats in the background. But these are my third purchase from Lululemon, and these are the On The Fly 7-8 pant. This, this is in like the gold color. It's a little bit more yellow in person, and it goes right above the ankle, as you can see, a little bit tapered. These are really nice. These are in the woven fabric as well. These have not pilled on me, so that's awesome. I don't know why the blue ones have, but these are perfect for like a dress pan. You can wear them with heels going out. You can wear them to work. They don't look great with running shoes, which is something that I wear to work quite a bit, but they look, do look really good with uh, flats. And it's just nice in the summer to break it up with a little pop of color, I guess, in your pant. And then I usually wear like a blue, black, or white t-shirt. So it looks presentable to work in the hospital, but also the functionality is really great as well. So they're exact same size six in these two. Okay, so I just tucked my top under here to show you these. So these are from Aritzia. These are the Atmosphere seven inch length short. They go about mid thigh, I think. This is what they look like. This is the back. 
So they do have that little Aritzia symbol on the back there, which is okay because it's in kind of like a darker color. These are really nice. These are my first uh, biker short, I guess you could say. I got these in a size small. I probably could have got with a size medium because I am having a little bit of camel toe. The waist is nice. It's not digging in anything like that. So I think if you do accidentally get a size down, it's okay. If you get a size above, that's okay as well. I'm trying to hop on the biker short trend, but like, I'm not sure. Like I would never wear a crop top like this out in public. So I would wear kind of like the baggier ones. But I don't know. I don't know if I, I don't know if I love it. I was going to get the Lululemon Align ones because I heard they were a little bit uh, softer, but they're like $80 and these were on sale at the Ritzia sale for 28. So I decided I'll just get these, check them out. They do suck you in pretty good. And like if you have Wonder Unders, this is the fabric that they're in. They're really nice for $28. So yeah, definitely recommend these if you want to try out the biker short trend and don't want to spend hundreds of dollars. So this dress is so cute. It's from Aritzia from Sunday's best line. I got it in a size four. It's a little bit tight around here. Like if I had a bigger rib cage, it would be too small. And again, like I'm wearing a bra, but in the boob area, they don't give you much room to be honest. So I don't know if you had bigger boobs than me. I'm a 32D that you wouldn't be like suffocating. Oh, it has this cute little ruffle detail here at the side and it's not too short to be honest. I got it on sale for $59 and I would 100% recommend. For Sunday's Best, I find they run a little bit small. So if you're in between sizes or again, like have a bigger waistline, or bigger boobs, I would recommend sizing up in this cute little tie. But yeah, definitely recommend. So this is another cute little dress. It's from Wilfred. It is called, I think it's called the shirt dress, but I'll leave the description down below in the link. Um, so you can button this all the way up. It has a little button here. The buttons do work all the way down. So if you're feeling risque, you can open this one up or have a cute little bralette. And then it's a little bit longer than the other dress. So it's, I guess, more conservative, especially because they have sleeves. It's not too tight. It does have pockets. So I really like this dress. It was on sale for, I think it was $100, regularly $148 and it's more like a casual daytime dress. You can wear it with shoes. Actually, I'll go get my shoes one second. How cute is this outfit? With these shoes. This is a real like A plus. Let me give you a whole, a whole shebang. There we go. I actually got these Air Force ones a few days ago. Yeah, they're pretty good. I ordered them in a size five kids. I'm normally a size six and a half women's. I could have definitely ordered a four and a half. I did put insoles in them. But yeah, so recommend Air Force Ones if you wear ladies, and I think up to a size nine. Just get two sizes down in the kids' Air Force Ones and you'll be gold and you'll be saving like $35. Well, Canadian anyway. So yeah, so such a cute little outfit. 
definitely perfect for a little garden party or just going shopping on the town. Okay, so I'm kind of cheating with this dress because I got it a few years ago, but the style is still online and I believe some patterns are on sale. So this one is from Sunday's Best as well. It's in a size small. So I think it's so cute. I wore it to my girlfriend's engagement party or rehearsal dinner, rehearsal dinner, I think. And it's gorgeous. Like, I really, really like it, especially with heels. It's a little bit short, especially in the center part, like pink. But if you're having like a gender reveal, this dress, going to a party, a summer gathering would be phenomenal. It is kind of booby. I don't have boobs, so if I did, they would be, I guess, a little more out and about. And I love how you can make it cinch in as much as you want. And it doesn't look like bad at the back. So I definitely recommend just staying your size in this. Okay, last but not least is this shirt from Babaton. It is a little camisole, excuse my bra, with some mesh over here. It's gorgeous as well and it feels like silky. As you can see, it does wrinkle quite easy. It's been hung up in my closet and I haven't actually worn this one out yet. I got it in a size extra small, so I would recommend sizing down in these because it is made a little bit bigger. And then make sure you adjust the straps because it does plunge quite low. I don't know. I just really love the shirt and it's a great staple to have because you just throw this on with any type of bottoms and it's going to look really good. So everyone, before I forget, thank you so much for watching this quarantine haul. Again, I probably spent way too much money on clothes that I don't really need, but number one, Aritzio was having a sale. Number two, I did need work clothes. So those are my excuses, take them or leave them. But if you haven't, please subscribe down below and I'll have all the links for these items if I can find them again down below. So happy Canada Day and happy July 4th to everyone and see you soon.